I realized um, during the class was that it was like therapy times a hundred. It was everything that I was looking for and more. Um, not only can we move creatively, um, draw, speak freely, um, express ourselves with various noises and all these different things that I never do in my normal life, but probably should do. Uh, it, it helped me to be the playful person that we all start off life being and then somehow lose and through gaining that, um, that playfulness and that femininity, I am able to interact with the world in a completely different way now where things aren't as stressful and serious and I could kind of let things roll off my shoulders. I could handle life a lot better. I'm more confident in myself. Um, a lot of the self-touch exercises, for whatever reason, were really difficult for me in the beginning, but uh, I think it was difficult, I realized, because I needed it so much. I was lacking in the appreciation of my own body. Mm -hmm. And um, it's just really simple things that you could do to really engage with yourself again. Um, because if you don't engage with yourself, how are other people supposed to engage with yourself? Most powerful thing that I got from this whole experience was remembering that it's okay to be feminine. And uh, sometimes we grow up in a very macho world and, you know, it's not cool to be sensitive or, you know, you have to like just be tough and hold back. And, you know, I feel like girls' personalities just suffer a little bit when they do that and being able to reconnect with like knowing what it means to be feminine, being able to move like a woman, being able to speak like a woman and like just anything that connects you with your true identity is just a powerful tool. Thank you.